tutorial on how to play Way to Go by Empire of the Sun. We're in standard tuning, there's no capo. There are a few bar chords here, so if you're a beginner, be aware of that. Um, we're gonna get started here with the verse. I'll also be teaching you the pre-chorus, the chorus, and the bridge. So we, I'm gonna go over the chords here real quickly. We have a B minor seven, so you're gonna bar, or actually that's just a B minor. Um, so you're gonna bar the second fret with your index finger. Fifth string down, middle fingers on the third fret of the B, ring fingers on the fourth fret of the D, pinkies on the fourth fret of the G. There's your B minor. So your B minor seven, you're gonna have your index finger on the second fret of the A string, middle fingers on the second fret of the G, and your ring fingers all the way up there on the second fret of the high E. For G chord, your ring fingers on the third fret of the high E, middle fingers on the third fret of the low E, index is on the second fret of the A. For an A chord, your index, your middle finger is going to start on the second fret of the D, ring fingers on the second fret of the G, pinkies on the second fret of the B. And then we also have a D chord where your index finger is on the second fret of the G. Middle fingers on the second fret of the high E, ring fingers on the third fret of the B string. You play those four strings. And those are all the chords you need to know to play this. So, having said that, let's jump into the verse here. We start off on our B minor chord, and we're going to pick our root A note, or not our A note, our B note, A string. And then you're going to pick the G and the B. And it, what they do to get that bass going is they pick that root note twice, so you hit it once, play those two strings, and then you hit it quickly twice. So... After you do that four times, you're going to switch to your B minor 7, play the same strings, go to our G chord, Stand that for two measures. So nice and slow, that's the verse. Right, we'll go over it again here. One. To your B minor seven. To your G. Stand up for two measures. It, and then that leads into the pre-chorus. The pre-chorus we start on a B minor again. Same strumming pattern, same chords, or same chord to start out here, so you only do that twice, and then you switch to an A chord. Do that twice, and you go to a G chord. And you can stay on that G chord for one full measure. So this you're gonna do that twice in the pre-chorus, so I'll go go over how that sounds. B minor, A, G. And the chorus itself is almost the exact same, except for instead of playing a B minor, we're going to play a B minor 7, so it goes B minor 7. Seven, A to your G. And that's it. And then it goes right back into the verse. So that's the verse, pre chorus, and chorus. There's one last thing to talk about here, which is the bridge, and that's where that D chord comes in. So you can play D. For four bars and then G for four bars. D for four bars. Back to your D. To the G. Back to the D. And you finish on an A. And then it goes into the chorus. 
So that's it. So in the bridge, it's D to G for three times, and then on the fourth time, it's D to A, and then you jump back into the chorus. So that's the bridge, the chorus, the pre-chorus, and the verse. I went through that all very quickly, so if you have questions, go ahead and comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.